Welcome to this video tutorial on how to ask a clinical question about the effects of a physiotherapy intervention in PICO format. Before you start searching for clinical research, it is best to spend some time thinking about the question you want to answer. This is because forming and refining your question makes it easier to find research to answer it. A useful memory aid for asking questions about the effects of physiotherapy intervention is PICO or PICO, where P is the patient or problem, I is the intervention or treatment, C is the comparator intervention, and O is the outcome. You use these components to define your clinical question. Including each component will make your question clearer. The patient for a PICO question is an individual or population defined by a particular problem, condition, or characteristic. Examples are older people, children with cerebral palsy, elite athletes, or people with low back pain. An intervention is the treatment you are interested in, such as balance training, hydrotherapy, manual therapy, or treadmill training with body weight support. The comparator intervention can be a control or alternative treatment. If it is a control, it can be no treatment or placebo or sham intervention. Otherwise, the comparator can be any treatment you want to compare to the intervention, such as usual care or a different treatment. The outcomes are the patient-relevant effects of the interventions and may include balls, pain, swelling or upper limb disability. Let's refine a very broad question into a PICO question. The broad question is, how should I treat Parkinson's disease? The only component of PICO in this question is the P for patient or problem, that is, Parkinson's disease. This means that you only have one option for selecting search terms, the patient. Just using a search term for the patient can be inefficient as there are usually a large number of articles available for each patient population, too many to consider to inform practice. When I searched for Parkinson using the Pedro Advanced Search in January 2021, there were over 700 articles in the search results. That is far too many to consider to answer the question. One strategy to narrow down your search results is to identify more search terms. To do this, we need to add components of a PICO question to our clinical question. Let's think about the I component of PICO, which is for the intervention or treatment. We need to be more specific about the treatment we are interested in. One strategy for Parkinson's disease is using visual or auditory cues to change stepping rate. So we could replace how should I treat with training using visual or auditory cues. Let's think about the C component of the PICO format, which is for the comparator intervention. What do we want to compare our intervention with? Let's compare it to usual care. Now what about the outcome? Think about an outcome that people with Parkinson's disease would think was important enough to seek physiotherapy treatment for. What about falling? So our PICO question is, in people with Parkinson's disease, does training using visual or auditory cues reduce the risk of having a fall compared to usual care? We now have four options to choose from to select search terms. But importantly, you do not need to specify all of the PICO components in your search. Usually just one or two are enough. A good starting point is to enter terms for the patient and intervention components of your question. Another example of a PICO question is, in older women with stress incontinence, does adding biofeedback to pelvic floor exercise reduce the loss of urine compared to pelvic floor exercise only? Again, this gives us four options to choose from when selecting search terms. The patient is older women with stress incontinence. The intervention is adding biofeedback to pelvic floor exercise. The comparator is pelvic floor exercise only, and the outcome is loss of urine. We have just demonstrated how to ask a clinical question about the effects of physiotherapy intervention in PICO format, where P is the patient or problem, I is the intervention or treatment, C is the comparator intervention, and O is the outcome. Using the PICO format makes clinical questions more precise. This will make it easier to find research to answer your clinical questions. 
you can use your PICO question to select search terms for your Pedro search. But remember, you do not need to specify all of the PICO components in your search. We hope that you have found this tutorial on how to ask a clinical question in PICO format useful.